guys! Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to share with you guys how to make a delicious burrito a la mexicana. In case you guys want how to make this super easy and delicious breakfast burrito, just stay tuned and I'll show you how. Alrighty guys, so let's get started with our ingredients. So for this recipe we're going to need one cup and a half of pinto beans, eggs, burrito flour tortillas, six ounces of bacon, eight ounces of chorizo, a half of a small white onion chopped, one Roma tomato chopped, one jalapeño or chile serrano chopped, pickled jalapeño peppers plus a quarter cup of juice, your choice of cheese, and avocado. So these are ingredients, now let's get started. All right guys, so first we're going to start by making our beans. So we're going to grab a medium frying pan, we're going to set it on medium heat, and we're just going to wait for that to heat up. All right, so once our pan has heat up, we're going to throw in our bacon. So just cut it into small pieces. So break it down. All right, so now we're just going to cook our bacon for five minutes. All right, so after five minutes, we're going to add half of our onion, along with our chorizo. So just break it down and continue cooking it together. All right, so we're just going to let it cook for five minutes. All right, so after five minutes, we're going to remove our mixture from the oil it to the side for now and try to get as much oil as possible all right so now we're going to use the oil to refried our beans And depending if your beans are cold, then you're just going to let them cook for a little bit. But since mine are fresh, so now I'm just going to um, smash them. And I'm gonna use a cup, sorry. All right, so once our beans are smashed, now we're going to add our juice from the jalapenos. And I chopped one jalapeno, but that's all optional. So just mix it together. Just return the mixture back. And let that cook together for a couple minutes. All right, so after a couple minutes, we're going to add our cheese. And I'm using medium cheddar cheese. So just let that melt. And now we can set it to the side and we can work on our eggs. All right, so our pan, we're going to set it on medium heat. We're going to add a little bit of oil. And we're just going to wait for that to heat up. All right, so once our oil is hot, we're going to add the remaining of our onion. Our Roma tomato. And our jalapeno. So we're just going to cook them for a couple minutes before we add our eggs. All right, so after a couple minutes, we're going to add our eggs. Season them with salt. And now just cook them all together. And don't let them stick to your pan. All right, so once our eggs are fully cooked, remove them from the heat and don't let them burn. So now we are ready to make our delicious burritos a la mexicana. All right, so now just heat up your tortillas. All right, guys, and now for the fun part, making our burritos. So we're going to start by adding our beans. Let me tell you, that smells delicious. I'm going to add some queso fresco. A couple slices of avocado. And then top it with our egg. Okay. I'm going to close it, close it, and roll it. 
And of course you can add potatoes if you want. But for me this is perfect. Back to the grill. So let that you can seal your burritos. All right, so once they're nice and grilled all around, we are ready to serve. And I'm just going to serve them with the jalapenos. That's it. And enjoy. Alrighty guys, and now for the best part, the taste test. Look at that, so pretty, enjoy. Mm-hmm. Seriously, delicious. The best breakfast burrito. So good. Everything's so perfect. It's like seriously, the perfect combination. The egg. The egg. <laughs> mm -hmm. The best part. So low it, so low it. <laughs> You're making me shy. <laughs> mm -hmm. So good. Alrighty guys, and there you have it on how to make a delicious burrito a la mexicana. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video and if you did, please don't forget to give me a big thumbs up. Share with your friends and family. And if you recreate this recipe, please don't forget to tag me on any of my social medias. And if you're new to my channel, please hit that subscribe button so you guys can be part of our family. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video.